Hi there, it's Captain Have Fun. So we are cutting the fabric right now for the two pieces that have to be put together for to make a, a, a robin cape. This is uh, an, an example of what we're, we're trying to do right now. Here's one. Here's a complete, another one, you know, on an actual figure. So, so you do it. Yeah. Um, if you, this is the stencil that we used to, um, to draw out the, the line on there. It is, um, there you go, toyofaloy.com. Uh, he's got a lot of videos on YouTube, so go ahead and check him out, Toy Paloy. Uh, I would say subscribe and, and like and, and hit that bell on his videos, just like I'm going to ask you to do on mine. <laughs> so uh, please hit like and subscribe for not just me, but for this guy. Because if we're not him, it'd be a lot harder to make these capes. So he has gone to a lot of work to make to find patterns and fabric and stencils and stuff. And I found this fabric on my own though. Uh, this, this is a kind of polished or shiny, I should say. Um, not necessarily satin. I was going to use satin, but, but this, this was close enough that I could find it was pretty affordable. Um, so that's what this one is. It's a type of shiny fabric that I got at Walmart. If you want to get fabric from Walmart, go during the day, <laughs> not go after hours or in the evening because it's going to be a fun time finding someone to cut it for you. I would know. This uh, is going to be the longest um, cape to make because it's simply because we have to do this whole part right here, which is usually not part of cape making. You don't normally need a uh, sewing machine to. Yeah, I mean, the, the only reason we're having to use a sewing machine is just because um, it's a double sided cape. <laughs> it's two pieces of fabric sewn together with a cape clip inside. Not that difficult, but a lot harder than just cutting some fabric and sewing a clip in, you know? Something wrong with it? Just make it smooth. Yeah. It's, it's, it's too, too, much. too much. It's very nice. It's too smooth. And it's too soft. Okay. Okay, it doesn't look bad. It doesn't look bad at all. Just need to fix the edge a little bit. Yep. I saw that. These are special fabric cutting scissors for making clothes. Uh, they're not regular scissors, so that's why they're so long. Uh, kind of scary looking. Like a Jordan Peele movie, maybe? <laughs>
But um, they're they're for the I know they look creepy, right? Yeah, you no, know, they're actually for for doing things. It's just nobody sews anymore in America, so oh, little creepy scissors. <laughs> Okay, then we just need to fold, fold the, this right, over. and then yeah, paint the pocket and then okay. put the the, cli um, the clips right there like next to your left hand. Okay. That little black so, circle there. Just need to fold this a bit over. Can you use you hands on this as well? They're beautifully. People actually pay like twenty dollars for this or more. I'm thinking that that yeah yeah from from the cape man. It's uh it's probably gonna be more. I don't know, but it's a lot more work. Maybe he's making it over on the back end with his lassos. It costs twenty dollars. Take. 30 seconds to make. Jesus Christ. I just couldn't do that. <laughs> I couldn't sell this stuff. And, like, especially like the lassos. They just take no time. If I were to sell a lasso, it'd be like probably over the same price of the shipping. Just want to fix the edge a little bit. <clears throat> Okay, then we can put this clip. Yeah, you um, right, you kind of put it, peel it out flat, but don't break it, and you, you just push it in. Yeah. Yep. So as I'm trying, trying to tell people here, um, so what you want to do right now is she's made a little area there where we're just gonna flatten out that clip I've made out of a sharpie cap. I'm gonna put that in there. Push it through. We're kind of playing around with different uh, heights here because we don't have a tune drake pattern. So the um, the cape stencil that I'm using here, or let me use it. This is the uh, 1984 Superpowers um, stencil for Superman. So because. Tim Drake's cape is a little bit longer than Dick Grayson's, so because we have the uh, he has the, the Dick Grayson pattern, but that's that's a no go here. Wonder if this will work for. Old, the old big crazy there. So I don't want to waste this. See, I think that fabric that you're using there is almost the same as my cape. Feels about the same, about the same shininess. I think that one's a little better. And my idea to do this with shiny <laughs> fabric was born out of watching uh, Burt Ward, uh, the, uh, the 1966 capes.